Hello, how are you doing? Get ready for work. Keep leaving later and later. <sighs> I need my sleep. I only get at best like four hours of sleep anyways. And <laughs> Well, she's, um, how should I put this, taking college classes. Again, she's a nurse and she's trying to up her thing. And I'm not against it. But, <clears throat> it's kind of like she's mad at me. Because I'm supposed to give her all the answers. And I can't just make it easy for her. And she's also at a level that is a little um, <clears throat> beyond me to begin with. I mean, I kind of remember it, but all right, I didn't take college algebra. And well, I took college algebra. I didn't take algebra in high school. I was a jock. I took business math. You know what I mean? Which, by the way, was the best math class I've ever took in my life. I had a teacher showing so many tricks on how to add numbers quickly. and You know, it, that should have been the required class, the business math class. That should have been required. Algebra should have been an elective. Because <laughs> it taught all this shit you actually needed to know. And I passed college algebra half asleep. You know, had a newborn, had two jobs, had it was too much. I was getting less than 20 hours of sleep a week, something I had to give. You know, like 15 years later, I'm like, did I pass? And so I had to look it up. And guess what? I passed. What the fuck is wrong with these people? I'm usually actually pretty good with numbers. But the thing is, I haven't had to use anything like that since I've done construction. Okay, how I really learned how to do algebra was, you know, figuring out how much dirt was coming out and how much needed to be put on doing dirt work. Having a level and a transit. <coughs> you can get a lot of work done with a level working off grade six. But oh, I can't see a fucking thing. Lovely, 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 lovely. Should I have even stopped? Well, yeah, because I needed the gas. So I probably should have stopped. I needed gas. So the gas is done. But I am running late, so now I'm meeting the school buses and all that kind of stuff. I never want to be leaving that late. But she's giving me nightmares of, like, polynomials and graphing lines and all kinds of shit because she's sitting beside me and she's reading the problem out loud not you know mumbling to herself she's reading it out loud 
Why? Because she's mad at me. That's why. And I gotta go to work. And I'm like, you do realize that yeah, I understand I don't have much money right now and part of because I just got too many bills, too many things financed and it's gonna be about four more years-ish before I'm out of this situation. Yeah, but there's light at the end of the tunnel. I need to get one thing sold or one thing paid off and I'll be doing good. I just have like one too many things and but I'm like you realize even if you advance your degree and you get that extra letter on there or what have you whatever it is I still make more money I mean just saying I didn't tell her that out loud. You know, I was thinking it. <coughs> You'd think I smoke like three packs a day. I need to start if I'm going to be coughing anyways. I think I either have tuberculosis or um, it's just all the dust at work. I don't know. I shall find out one day. Or at least the coroner will when they do an autopsy. They'll be able to figure that out. Lord knows I can't. <clears throat> and it's froggy. Froggy, froggy, froggy. Dodge Ram Laramie. There was a little while where I was wondering what were all these pickups? What, what was the MAR and an abbreviation for? I'd see M A R in my mirror. And then I figured it out. I'm an idiot. Oh, look at the froggy mother. about the AIDS pandemic, epidemic, whatever. Not till his friend died. <coughs> oh, Rock Hudson, how could you? Oh, uh, there's people worried about Fauci with uh, COVID and all that. I mean, Fauci should have been hung for what he did during AIDS. You know. 
He had a track record that wasn't good to begin with. Everyone is driving slowly. I do not like the slowly. God damn, I can't see a fucking thing. And it's not just that, it let me wipe this. Yeah, cause it's all the water on my visor. It's like not quite running off of it. If it was running off of it, it'd be fine. But it's like there's no fog right here. But you still get the water on the visor. I don't know what hit me in the shin, but that hurt. It hoi! It's too much. world it's too much it's too much for me I can't take it and there's concrete trucks know where those places are where you're gonna pull where they're gonna pull out or they spread shit all over the road it would help tremendously because you know then you're kind of expecting if you come up and they got it all fucked up you know, you, you're looking ahead for it. You don't want to come up there and the road's all fucked up last minute. Oh, shit! And I still got that shit all over my face. Or... They need a windshield wiper for your visor. You just push like a little button on your helmet. Right, goes... right, left. Right, left. There we go. Low battery. That would be my car though. Might just be my brain. My brain has a low battery at the moment. It's about to turn the fuck off. It needs coffee. It needs coffee. Coffee would be good. Coffee would be awesome. I could really um, flex the whole white girl thing and get me a big pumpkin spice latte. That actually sounds good. So I need to be leaving the yard right now. I mean, I don't have a time to show up. I just got to pick these things up before they close. But I need to be leaving the yard about right now. And I'm going to be f like effed no matter which way. Why am I saying F? I'm going to be fucked no matter which way I go through traffic. You know, you know, you know. <clears throat> and everybody's gonna drive slow. Trying to go to the why won't it go to the right? There we go. That is not right. It is, it is not good. Don't you run that thing. You gotta watch that out in the country. You know, even when you don't see the headlights, you see that dust cloud coming. And it's coming a little too fast. And you're coming up on the intersection. Those people might not be stopping. My sister got an accident. She's like, they had a stop sign. And I'm like, that don't mean shit. Make sure like the 
see all my fingers. They'll, they'll think I'm, um, whatchamacallin' it, like, flipping them off or something. I'd hate for them to think that. Unless I intended to. Good lord, where am I? I have no fucking idea. And I still have no fucking idea. Where are you, my friend? I don't know. It's a soup. I am in the soup. Soupy, what was that thing? God. Heard Iggy Pop say it once with some line from some can of soup. And like Chicago or Detroit. That's where he got his idea for how he wrote his songs. Kind of like the cadence and how many words and everything. I cannot see. Oh, that's why it's my glasses. My actual glasses decided to fog up. Yeah, sometimes I can be that stupid. Can you? I don't know. I do not know. I don't know, I can't really see anything. I can't see none of this. This would be a safer place to stop. Okay, I gotta do this. The truck kind of sounds good. Kind of, sort of, maybe, possibly, you know. Not sure how much fuel I have in my truck. The problem with that one, even though it's old, it's newer. And it's those years where they were, um... They started putting like 80 gallon tanks on shit. You know? Yeah. It's like 80 gallon tanks. And they cut one of them in half. So it's only 40. Because the rest of it's filled with hydraulic fluid. Well. That causes a problem. I've only got 120 gallons. So you gotta fill that truck up every freaking day. I know that may sound like a lot of fuel to people in cars that have never drove trucks. But we go through like 120 gallons a day. That's why we've got those big old tanks. And I gotta run about 500 miles today. In a truck that averages about 5.8 ish. 
I'm gonna have to fill up and I don't know where I'm gonna fill up I don't know how, I don't remember I think I got close to a quarter tank I'm not sure you know I would like to get to the other side of Houston if I can but I might not and I might have to fill up on this side and then I don't want to fill up on this side for several reasons. One of them is there's going to be big long lines. And the other is it puts me that much further into traffic. It is what it is. Nothing I can do about it now. Because I had Charlie Brown's teacher beside me in a loud voice going, wow, 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 wow. And I was trying to sleep. You know? That's all I wanted was some sleep. Is that too much to ask for? Is a little bit of sleep too much to ask for? Apparently it is. <sighs> Even if I know the answer, I can't just give her all the answers because she's going to have to take a test. And she's going to have to know how to do that shit. Like, keep working the problem. You already know how to, you don't, if you already know how to work the problem, you don't need me to show you how to work the problem. You need the repetition of doing the problem over and over and over. So that when you get to the test, you do the problem and you arrive at the correct answer. That's kind of where she's at. She's got her graphing calculator and all that crap. I don't give a shit. I don't really use a calculator. <laughs> I try to use my head. And I have always been that way. So here's the thing. Up. Oh, there we go. <clears throat> now that second gear. Now the cars won't stop coming. Oh good lord. There's just so many cars. So many cars. I just need a little gap. I probably could have timed that one. Visor up. That was a rock to the forehead. Lovely. Shouldn't be as much traffic going the other way. Shouldn't. That don't necessarily mean nothing. I should have probably went. I slipped and grovelled that one time right there. Right here. And I, I, I had a momentary thought of what if.
God, Methuselah's gonna turn. Sometimes the days go good, and it's fucking awesome. 
lot of times, you know, shit's fucked up. And, you know, sometimes I don't even have anything to do. A lot of the times I don't even have anything to do with it. It just is. And I deal with it. And then sometimes it's my own damn fault. And I still deal with it. But yet I persevere. I keep pushing. thought but kind of a well duh you know because if you're going to make a long trip on a bike you know you, you just need to be prepared to ride in things like rain and it does help to ride when you're closer to home it's more familiar and to get used to the shit you know there's people that never ride in the rain but now you want to go take a trip halfway across the country. But you don't ride in the rain. What you gonna do? So it's our gonna ride in some rain. Yes, it is, right? Uh, seven o'clock straight up and down. straight up and down. Now it's probably 701. It floods. It's meant to flood. It was supposed to flood. Notice the fields around it. You know. That right here is where the black top would pick up. Everything behind me was dark. But anyways running out of real estate so thank you for listening to me ramble on about bullshit you're awesome and I gotta go haul ass both hands if you don't get that picture of a little kid when they're little you know mom saying I'm gonna whoop your ass and they're running around the corner they got both hands on their ass that's something my mom used to say haul ass both hands that just might get the lead out of your fucking ass get moving but anyways, I will catch y'all later. And thank you for watching. So, adios, fayo, adios, sayonara, hasta la vista, nasla, ciao. Y'all watch yourselves. Peace, yeah.